Please come to the third floor in Vrindavan Ghat. TCN Prakshakulki National Science Day Subha Kangshlu National Science Day Sandar Banga Mana Montessori School Lo Iroju Science Exhibition Nag Parchet and Jerigindi Pillalu Rakrakala Working Models Thayar Chesi World Scientific Thinking Ni Brothers in Shanik Praithis Naru Alage Quiz Karikramalu Essay Rating Competitions Lanti Guda Conduct Chest and Jeruthan Iroju Pillalon Sujinat Makadano Science Butler Walkuna Interest Ni मोटिवेट जैसे लगा इंक्रेस्ट जैसे भी दंगा ये रोज़ साइंस जैसे अपन जरूरत होंगे। ना अपना पैर वाइट चरण बाबू। ना पैर जैसे ऐस काट के आ। मैं मो ये मैं में दी छे डैम जैसा। मैं छे सं डैम डैम जैसा। इधि इधि देने की यूज़ होती है दंते मल्ल वाटर रेन वाटर सेव सेव गेट्स गेट्स लेपता हूँ लेपना पूरी वाटर अंता वैली समुद्र लोक का अलिस्पोदक अलिस्पोन आप पूरे आप दिली मले में ये ये फार्म फार्म्स की यानि उन टेक आ बिटली वालते दे वाट्स वाट्स वालते मले मैं ड्रिंक ड्रिंकिंग वाटर के तागरां के ये वाटर करने मन मन के दिस सेव सेव होते दे वाटर अंते डैम अं मतलब वाटर ये ये प्रेना सिटी रिस्की करी कुछ कुछ चिना पुरे वाट डैम आर के अंटे वाटर अंतर दिन लो कुछ सेव होती है My name is Sampad P. Sampad Kumar of 6C. My name is P. Sa P. Raghava of 6C. My project name is Forest of Animals. Hi, my name is P. Danvarshini. I am studying 6th class in A section, Montessori School. I am A. Krishnagan, studying in 7th B. Our project name is Water Boat. My name is T. Leela Sairam. I am studying 7th class. My name is T. Ishwar. I am studying 7th class. 7th C. Montessori School. My project name is Drip Irrigation. My name is K. Shishwini. I am studying 6th class in Montessori school. My project name is Natural Resource Water. Good morning to one and all. My name is S. Pranita Shri. I am studying 6th standard in Montessori school. My poster name is Plastic Wastage. Nowadays we are using plastic only. So this is the earth. 
the earth is crying because of the plastic we won't use plastic because nowadays we are using only plastic materials and things thank you good morning sir my name is v tamanna i'm studying 7th f my school name is montessori school my project name is rice mill hi everyone my name is hemastri i am studying 7th in montessori school we made a project called rice mill i will explain you now how the rice mill is first of all we have to take some rice and pour on the top part of the mill now switch on the motor we observe that the rice is converted into rice flour with the help of grinding wheels now we will get the pure and fine rice flour my name is pranashi katke i am studying 6th class mandisori school my project name is pinhole camera Good morning to one and all. My name is Joel. I am studying sixth class in Montessori School B section. My project name is Pinhole Camera. Good morning to one and all. My name is Farhana. I am studying sixth standard in Montessori School. Today about our project name is Water Cycle. Good morning to one and all. My name is J L Ashishri. I am studying sixth class in Montessori School. Today our project about water cycle. Our operation in water cycle there there are three main stages. They are evaporation, condensation, precipitation. God has given us so many wonderful things. One of such precious gift is water. So let me show you how water is circulate in nature. Evaporation means uh, the process of changing water into water vapor is called evaporation. Condensation means the process of release of water water vapor into water is called condensation. Precipitation means the process of release of water the process of release of water. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, good morning to all. Uh, my my name is Pravalika. I am studying seventh class in Montessori School, Tanuku. And this one is my project. And this one bag is Corona virus. This one what has we got using a soap or alcohol based sanitizer. And second one, cover your mouth and nose. Uh, if you cough or sneeze with your elbow, maintain a distance from people having the flu symptoms. Go to the doctor. If you have a fever, cough, or breathing difficulty, if you go to the uh, market, don't touch animals or anything in the area they stay. Hi, I am Hi Umar Gwedi, studying seventh seventh class in Montessori School, Tanku. This is my pro this is my project. Hydronic hydronical lift. Hydronical lift is uh, a machine that is useful to lift a load with application of force on a on a on a liquid medium within a portion. And see this one. This one is hydraulic lift. And stand up. This one is standing position. Look at me. And this one is <laughs> down on this. But what? Okay. It's a And down. And expel. Good morning all. My name is Tejashwini. Good morning all. My name is JJS Monokavya. I am studying 7th class.
our project, project name, name is periscope good morning one and all my name is ramdeepka i am studying 8th class in montessori school my name is a lakshmi supriya i am lakshmi supriya we are studying 8th class in montessori school this is the our project name is agriculture model science this is the this is the field in earlier days animals used to enter the field and spoil the fields so in order to reduce this we have made this project so if any animal tries to enter the field it unexpectedly touches the circuit what we have made and a sound is produced from that circuit so the animal gets fear and it runs back it will be very helpful to the farmers and this is drip irrigation uh, instead of uh, watering the plants with our hands we can water the plants uh, in this method it is uh, it is time saving and it is very useful to farmers thank you sir My name is Anhamsini. I am studying 6th F in Montessori school. My poster name is Electricity. Electricity. We use electricity in many kinds of things in our daily life. Uh, examples, uh, lights, fans, TV, computers and uh, mobiles etc. Electricity is created by using wind, using solar power, using water. Electricity is transported by wires wires uh, to our homes, uh, schools and places of work. Electricity and water don't mix. Keep all electrical equipment away from water. Good morning, sir. Good morning to all. My name is Asrija. My name is Gayatri Valli. Our project, project name is Earthquake Alarm. With this device we can, we can save the lives of people. When the earthquake vibrates, that suspended thread will be connected to this one and when the suspend when the when this was uh, oscillated this uh, connected uh, by uh, connected with negative safety. terminal positive terminal the terminal connected to the bulb and bulb and alarm and those will be on when the earthquake comes so like this we can save the lives of people uh, who are surrounding we can uh, send the people to another place Good morning sir, my name is Jahnavi. My name is Fahnita. This project name is Waste Water Treatment Plant. This is help us to recycle the water. And first, the water we have... First, we will collect the raw water from the drainages. After, it will go to coagulation tank. And uh, the impurities will freeze in it. And it will go to flow collation tank, where the impu impurities come up and the water will go down after sedimentation tank separation of impurities and the water after it go to filtration tank where the impurities will stay and the water let the water flow after it will go to storage tank where the treated water is stored and it will distribute to the industrial purposes and the agricultural purposes constructing of buildings Good morning, my name is Raman and my friend's name is Ram Kumar. Our project is about thermocool cutting gadget. With this gadget we can cut the thermocool very easily. The main principle of this gadget is to convert electrical energy into heat energy and cut the thermocool very neatly. If we cut with scissor, if we cut with scissor, the shape will come into irregular. But if we use this uh, machine, there will be no dust like this. And we can cut the thermocol very neatly. This will be very useful to us. See how much accurately the shape is coming. Good morning, Good morning. Good morning. My name is A. Sai Pawan. My name is P. Reshwant. We are done the project is hydraulic arm. The hydraulic arm system is works on the principle of the pressure is an enclosed fluid constant in the all the directions concept of this project is transmitting the force from one point to another point through the help of the fluids. Now, the applications 
of this project is it is used in textile industries it is used in um, plast arms of the arms of the garbage truck and it is also used in seaports the benefits of this hydraulic arm is it can't produce any pollution and also it is an highly capable for loading the heavy loads and better than the mechanical arms and the electrical arms thank you Hello to all TCN viewers. My name is SK Abubakar Siddiq of 9th F and he is my mate. Hello, I am Allah Anand Sitaramiya from 9th B. And we are going, our project is to make biogas using cow dung. It is very cheap to produce also. It takes less time, it takes some more time, but it produces gas in very high quantity. If, let's see this. You can see small flame, pike, pike. Take it out, take it out, little. Let it. It takes some time to liberate. Okay, this is the flame which we got from the gas, and you can see flame. If it is uh, liberated in heavy quantity, we can make it in tanks, we can use it in cooking and uh, we can use it in our vehicles also and this is our project. Thank you. Good morning. I am H inside age of 90. Our project is microphone. Our microphone works on one battery and lights. Without using mic, our project will work sir. If we talk in this, we will come to his. here, sir. Without using the mic, mic, we cannot talk, sir. It helps to transfer voice for transfer. longer voice for longer distance. Very simple connection. Good morning to all. My name is ADP Srija. I am studying class 8. I make a project like a human respiratory system. Human respiratory system have two lungs and two lungs. Second lung, second lung is the biggest lung. It it functioning like that. In this Corona time, COVID-19 is a respiratory disease, one that especially reach into your respiratory tract. Thank you. Morning, ma'am. I am Harini from second class. Today, tell about clothes we wear. Now, I am going to explain about different types of clothes. Clothes protect us from heat, cold, rain, dust, and setbacks. Different people wear different types of clothes depending on the seasons. Those are cotton clothes. We get cotton from cotton plant. In summer, the weather is very hot, so cotton clothes absorb sweat from our body and they keep us cool. Next, coming to woolen clothes, we get wool from animals like sheep and camel. We get wool. We we wear woolen clothes in winter season. In in winter, the weather is very cold, so cot so woolen clothes absorb sweat. So woolen clothes, we, they protect us from cold and keep us warm. We, we also wear silk clothes in winter season. In silk, we get silk from silkworm. We also wear, we during the rainy season we get we wear rain coats and umbrellas to protect us from rain. Rain coats are made from plastic or rubber. We get rubber from rubber plant. Th those are about types of clothes. Thank you, ma'am. Good morning. This is Pikatke of second year presenting you different kinds of foods. Foods are three. 
we get food from plants and animals. We eat food to grow, stay healthy, and live. Foods are three types: and giving foods, body building foods, protective foods. And giving foods keep us healthy and give us energy to work and play. Example: rice, wheat, sugar, bread. Body building foods. Body building foods are building our body. Are called body building foods. They build bones and muscles. Example: eggs, milk, pulses, etc. Protective foods. Protective foods are mm, pro protective foods protect from mm, cereal diseases and uh, keep us healthy. Example: fruits, vegetables, etc. So eat healthy, stay healthy. Thank you. I am P.J. Shant of Class 8, Montessori School, with the posture about impact of wars and prospects for peace through scientific knowledge. I am K. Ramishal Reddy of ATF, standing in front of you to tell about the post of solar system. My name is K. Divya Today I am explaining human education empowerment. Good morning everyone. I am B. Kushisri from class 6. This is a skeleton. Good morning one and all. I am MD Saifuddin of class 8, Montessori School, Tanuku. Good morning, one and all. I am from Rishi. I am from class 8. Vacuum cleaner is, is one of the machine. It is used in hotels. It is used in hotels, restaurants, house, offices, etc. etc. Good morning one and all, my name is Ansanje. Our main theme is Lightning Arrester. Good morning to one and all, my name is Asham Nagapon of 8th F. Our poster name is Lightning Arrester. Hello everyone, my name is Harshmi. So what is the theme of our place in Save Trees and Paper? So our project making is paper industry. The process of first we want to cut the trees of paper making. Second, we'll cut the trees in shape. Third, paper roll. And fourth, binding machine from paper. From fifth point is nothing but we'll sell the stock in the bookstore. Hi, my name is S. Harshni. Our theme is paper industry. Good morning, one all. My name is Vishnu Satvik. My main theme is important of vaccination on our health and facing problems in corona pandemic. Good morning, one and all. My name is Manpran. I'm studying 8B from Montessori School. My main theme is uh, uh, importance of vaccination on our health.
my name is jayashni i am studying in montessori school the name of our con- concept is war uh, between ukraine and russia my name is pallavi i am studying in montessori school the concept is war between russia and uh, ukraine and dogs this is about respiration my name is utista this this girl name is jodhika we are preparing about respiratory system how to working my name is akile i am studying in fifth class this this is this name is Vahitana. my name is gautam he is my partner this is my working model My name is Jee Teja Achita. I am studying fifth class. My name is Dean Ushita Sai. I am studying fifth class. My project is the germination of seed. the stages of germination the germination is a process by which the baby seed baby plant, baby seed produces a baby plant this is called the germination my name is k ushan sir i am studying fifth class or happy science day i am my project is sources of water in world and days my name is and you and umasri panika aksha i am studying fifth class i am explaining about the solar system this is the sun mercury venus earth our natural satellite moon mars jupiter saturn uranus and neptune my name is lavanya i am studying fifth class this is, this is the circulatory system this is the aeronautum this is the right atrium this is the left left atrium this is the light le, right ventricle this is the left ventricle Good morning, sir. My name is Anshay Tanya. Of the today, I am going to explain about water cycle. The heat from the sun warms the water in the different water bodies. The water changes into water vapor and mixes into the atmosphere. and and mixes into the atmosphere this process is called evaporation when cloud become heavy and cannot hold any more water this this process is called as condensation when and cloud become heavy and cannot hold any more water water falls on the ground as rain this process is called evaporation this process is called precipitation the water the rain water falls back into the ocean seas rivers ponds and lakes the sun again heats up the water and rises up again to from clouds 
does the water cycle goes on in the atmosphere. This is water cycle. Thank you. My name is C.H. Umavashika. Leaves are the food factories of plants. They are mostly green in color because of the present green pigment chlorophyll. Leaves are different shapes and sizes. Some are round and some are triangular. Some are long. Uses of leaves. Some leaves are eaten as vegetables like coriander, spinach, banana leaves used as plates to serve food. Morning everyone, my name is Amruta. I am studying 4th class. I am going to tell you a few things about water pollution. When a river starts its journey from the mountains, it is clean. But when it enters to the cities, it is polluted. The factory wastes, household wastes and agricultural wastes are dumped into the water bodies. Here, factory waste is dumped into the river. Some people take bath near water bodies. They clean the clothes and cleaning the utensils. If the water is polluted, marine life is disturbed because of oil leaks from the because of oil leaks from the ships kills millions of innocent creatures. So we need to change of thinking and realize that we should not pollute the water. Thank you. Good morning everyone. My, my name is Jay Lakshmi. Today I am telling about the food spices. The, the, the spices give us taste and flavor to the food. These are th turmeric, these are cloves. I am studying fourth class. Now I am going to explain types of types of bridges. Clapper bridge. Clapper means clapper means a pile of stones. It is used. It is used old and days. Good morning to everyone. My name is Hishant, studying fourth class. Today I am going to explain about beaks of birds. Birds do not have teeth. They have a beak. Here are different types of beaks. Cracker beaks. Sparrows and pigeons have a cracker beak. Good morning to all. My name is Sempramila. I am studying 4th class. Today I am going to tell about food from plants. Good morning to everyone. My name is K.H. Saditya Arma. I am studying 4th class. I am going to tell about the kinds of teeth. Good morning to one and all. My name is P. Gaitri Geetka. I am studying 5th class. I am tell about nutrients. Good morning, one and all. My name is Vai Bargu Kumar. I am studying in fifth class. I will tell you the, the respiratory system. Sir. Good morning, everyone. My name is Salekya. My project is digestive system. Good morning to one and all. My name is Vishal. My project is nervous, the nervous system. Good morning to one and all. My name is T. Padmasri Anapona. I will do the excretory system. Good morning to one and all. My name is V. Gauri Harshita. I am studying 5th standard. This is my project, Numismatics.
morning. Good morning to one and all. My name is Sitesh. I am studying fifth class. My project is windmill. Happy Science Day. Good morning, one and all. My name is K. Jashwan. My project is windmill. Thank you. My name is Kundana. Happy Science Day. Good morning, one and all. My name is Sanjana. I, my project is respiratory system. Happy Science Day. Thank you. Hello. My, good morning. My name is B. Dasrat. These are our team. G. Deepakumar, K. S. Vinvikas. We are from class 8th, class 8th. This project name is Deep Irrigation. In rainy season, the water is collected and stored in this tank. This tank is directly connected to the service tank and this service tank will provide water for these plants. If in summer season there is no rainfall, so the well water will be, water will work for, for this plants. This, this, this motor will be connected to service tank. This water is, will provide the plants. Irrigation is recorded and this will be played in hologramic view and this will be recorded in this and this will play sir. In this this will record and from this we should see sir. It will show three dimensional sir. We can explain about this sir. About drip irrigation we can explain in this hologram sir. My name is Arish. My name is Anvodai sir. Today we are going to tell about the hydroelectricity. Hydroelectricity is worker. Is worker you should pour water in it as a result on that pipe onwards it will come it will rotate and the, as that light will grow this project this is used when when the crops are going to be harvested this is used this this electricity is used when the crops are going to be harvested Good morning. Welcome to our project. This uh, project name is uh, water, uh, water Level Alarm. This water level alarm is used to know the how much the water has been filled. Nowadays, owners and other household members are wearing water to store the water storage. After some time, the water gets flowed down after some time because the water gets uh, stored full. Again, then it will get allowed. And after this smart machinery helps to save the water flow if we pour how much the water has been increased and then it will be stopped hence there is a chance of overflow of water to resolve the this pro to resolve this type of problems we use this water leveling alarm it is used in factories, factories, chemical plants, apartments, etc. Good morning, ma'am. Now I am going to explain about food nutrients. These nutrients are carbohydrates, fats, proteins, vitamins, minerals, roughage and water. Now coming to carbohydrates. Carbohydrates are the nutrients which give us energy to grow. These are found in bread, honey, rice, sugar and wheat. Next, these are called energy giving for the next coming to fats. Fats are also energy giving for the These are mostly found in butter, ghee, rags, meat, oil and curd. Carbohydrates and fats are carbohydrates and fats are Energy giving for the next coming to proteins. Proteins help our body to to strong rip and repair the worn out cells in our body. These are found in milk, curd, uh, milk, curd, beans and pulses. These are called body building for the next coming to next coming to vitamins and minerals. Vitamins and minerals are found in fruits and vegetables. Fruits and vegetables which keep our bones and teeth healthy. These next, these rough, roughest help our body to roughest, roughest, 
Let's go to round number three. Students, before going to round number three, directly going to that round number three. Round number three is a passing method. You will have a passing question. Okay? If the question is asked directly to the given group, that will be a 10 mark answer. If it is passed, that will be for five marks. So group number one. There is a picture being displayed on the screen. Name the name the scientist that is displayed on the screen. Albert Einstein. Albert Einstein is a correct answer. Albert. Einstein is the correct answer. Question goes to group number two. There is a hint given on screen. Name the scientist that is displayed on your screen. Graham Bell, sir. Alexander Graham Bell is the correct answer. Very good. Next display to the next group. See the photo, photograph, and you have a hint. Graph. Very good. Jagdish Chandra Bose is a correct answer. Very good. Next, we have a scientist displayed on the screen. Name him. Ten marks for the next group number four. Thomas Alva Edison. Thomas Alva Edison. Very good. Ten marks for group number four. Very good. Next to display on the screen, this answer is for group number 5. Display on the screen. Homi Jai Baba. Homi Jahangir Baba. Remember friends, he is a very good nuclear physicist. Homi Jahangir Baba. Correct answer. 10 marks for group number 5. Graph to display on the third arm. Next picture please sir. Students, there is a question, smart question. The person name is given. He is Louis Pasteur. What he has invented, discovered? Pasteurization is a correct answer. Very good. Yes. With this, the round is completed. I'll tell you the score before going into the fourth round. Team number one, 40 marks. Team number 2, 35 marks. Team number 3, 20 marks. Three, team number 4, 38 marks. Team number 5, 10 marks. Team number 6, 30 marks.